Hello, this is Slightly Bad Fast to Pros and welcome to the C64 Code Hacking Tutorials YouTube channel. Now, I've decided that um, due to the reception I've had with the videos, I haven't got many comments and I've been accused of being a thief, a, a liar, a scammer and a spammer and uh, so someone that steals other people's hard work. Um, I've decided to not do any source code tutorials and for at least a week or possibly until after Christmas. So uh, if you really do want to learn code soon, I suggest you leave a comment and ask me to produce a coding tutorial. But I probably won't do it uh, for at least another week because I've had enough of being taken for granted in this, in this respect. So in the meantime, we'll only have um, games and de demos on, on this channel until I, I feel otherwise. Sorry, I said I wouldn't bring this up again, but I had to. Alright, now we're, we're going to check out my unreleased, unfinished game from 2005 called Tronsky. Oops. Whoops, we got the controls. Yeah, as you can see, it's made with Petsky computer graphics, um, and it's fully machine language uh, raster code, uh, and it, it features two multi-directional scrolling play fields, color cycling light bulb um, trails, and color cycling light bulbs as well as massive virtual play fields because as you can see I can drive around in here for ages without even going to the wall um, it's a two player game the only things that are unfinished uh, it doesn't print it doesn't print the other players bike on, on your screen And it doesn't have artificial intelligence or title screen or scoring yet. Those are minor things, but the drawing the, the player on each other, each other's grid is a lot harder than you might think. And I couldn't do it, so I had to abandon the project. And I recently sent it to Frank Gasking of Games That Weren't, and it'll be featured on Games That Weren't in December sometime then you'll be able to play this game and hopefully some enterprising um, developer will take up the reins and finish the code. Now, this video has probably been a bit boring, but um, I just wanted to show off the code that I can actually do. I programmed this in about three months. <sighs> yep. So that's what's possible using machine language and Petsky graphics. A pretty amazing production. If it had sound effects, it would probably be an almost finished game. But to be actually finished, it would have to have artificial intelligence for one play mode. Because it's hard to play two player games on the Commodore 64 these days because there aren't two people to play it. Huh. Alright, that's all for this video. If you'd like more information about Trotsky, just leave a message in the comments or um, wait for the release of games that weren't in early December. Alright, thanks a lot. I've, I've, I'm, yeah, sorry, sorry, I only got two hours of sleep last night because of the debacle on Facebook and I'm a little bit vague. <laughs> so I have to apologise for that. Uh, but for now, it's goodbye from me and hello to code. Good afternoon.